I was sitting on my porch. I was sitting down in the sun by the hot tub. Sitting down, recording a video. Talking my way through my thinking. Discussing my s what I should do with my life. Wondering how, why I can't change who I am. Why I can't change my habits. Why can't I start doing the right things. Why do I always fall for the bad habits and the vices I have? What can I do to change this? To stop the cycle? To start creating lasting change? Sustainable changes in my life? After I'm done recording that video and talking my, to myself and going through all that, I went into my room and I created a habit tracker. I got I got out a whiteboard. I got a what they call whiteboard markers. Made the grid on like this calendar you see here, right there. You can see it. And I made a habit tracker. And I've been tracking my habits that I've been doing every day since. Now, before you click on this video, habit tracking is super important. You might think you're like above habit tracking, but I'll get into that later in the video. You can always benefit from habit tracking. Here's how you will create your habit tracker. Here's the actionable step of this video. Right now, pause the video. You're going to want to get like printer paper and a pencil and some tape. Three things, pretty simple, right? So you're going to create your very own habit tracker, and this is going to help to change your life. I can't do this because I'm making a video. I can't like go in there and do the shit for you. You have to go out, get the, get the stuff I told you, paper, pencil, tape whatever so your habit tracker you're gonna track some habits on this paper you're gonna make a grid start tracking some habits your phone will not suffice for a habit tracker I used to do this I actually made a video back back in the day on tracking habits I was talking about this app called habit habit to tea it's basically a habit tracking app that you have on your phone and I had to learn firsthand by experience that Having a habit tracker on your phone is not going to work. It's too easy just to forget about an app on your phone. I have, like, so many apps on my phone. And guess what? I only use, like, 10% of the apps on a regular basis. The rest of them are just in the background. Like, well, I, have a, I have a calculator app on my phone. But, I like, barely, I never use it. <laughs> I might start using it once I go to school and I have a math class. But, yeah, it's too easy to forget about an app. You need to... Make a habit tracker, and you need to hang it somewhere in your room where you see it every day. Where it stands as a reminder that you're missing out on these habits, that you're not doing the things you need to do. So have it somewhere to remind you every day. Like right there, my door is right there. Every day when I walk in, my habit tracker is right there, and I can see if I'm doing the habits that I should be doing every day. Another example of this is my accountability mirror. Let me see. Right there. That is, I write down my goals and stuff, and every day, like, if I look at myself in the mirror, grooming myself, grooming, is that a good, right word? But anyways, you see, I see my goals, I see, it keeps me accountable, holds me responsible. You, you have to have these visual reminders that, like, come out in your daily life. So, what you're going to do, you're going to make a grid. You know what I'm talking about. I shouldn't be that complicated like that, like a grid. So just like like this, basically a habit tracker. And every day, once you do the habit, you mark it down. And that means you've done the habit. Some days are going to be different from others. You might like miss a few habits every day. It's going to look might look something like this you might miss a few habits that's okay that's that just shows you need improvement and that means you're challenging yourself if you're missing habits you shouldn't miss them but it's about tracking them tracking is the important part so just make a habit tracker like that let me actually show you mine because I don't like that here so you can see we have some stuff we have wake up early Today I managed to wake up early. This is, I just don't check it. 
So your goal of this thing is to not break the chain, to keep like a consistent row of X's. But if you mess up one, it's okay to like... You're, it's not over. So it's just about tracking your habits and building consistency. Like, something I consistently do every day without fail is creatine and workout. Those are like really strong habits. Stretching is kind of a new one. I don't normally stretch, but I'm trying to do it. Recording, just, so yeah, that's my habit tracker. And also about these habits, if you're just starting out, you need to start small. You need to make easy habits instead of just like right off the bat, break down hard shit like ice bath every day. Um, meditate for an hour, record four work, four hour deep work session. I'm not going to tell you to do the super hard stuff off the bat. You need to do easy stuff first so you can make the changes sustainable. You need to practice the art of showing up every day. If you just have a bunch of hard habits, you're not going to check any. So you need to start off with easy ones. Of course, there's going to be people who say, you know, I don't need this. It's not important. You don't need to track your habits. But anyone can benefit from this. We, everybody has habits. Habits lead to success. Uh, success is built on the stuff we do every day. Like every day, you have these specific routines. Like every day I work, every day this, that. So if you, so you are built on your habits. There's this quote I really like by Carl Jung. He says, until you make the unconscious conscious, it will direct your life and you will call it fate. So you can never know what habits are going on until you start tracking them, until you start making that habit tracker and making your habits conscious, what you are and are not doing on a daily basis. You'll never know, like, you'll call it fate. You'll never make any change. So you have to start tracking them. I want to relate a similar story to kind of what I'm doing to Hamza. So I, I watch, like, Hamza's old videos and stuff. And he was really into habit tracking as well. He he moved back to his like parents' house. He was like living in an apartment and stuff. He had really bad mental health. But he moved back out to the countryside, sort of with his parents, lived in his parents' house, and he started tracking his habits every day. He started do starting small things, like small habits that were sustainable, like meditate for one minute do 20 push-ups, just small stuff, and he slowly amped those up, and now this guy's like super successful, super big entrepreneur guy. So habit tracking is real, is real, it will help you if you can stick with the program and just do the steps I give out to you in this video. If you haven't already, make that habit tracker, write down some habits, some really simple ones you can copy from mine even, work out, stretch, meditate, journal, just simple stuff. You can add more habits as you get better. Your goal is just to do those every day. Now, I can understand if you, like, still don't feel like making a habit tracker. You might feel like, I'm above this. There's, but there's no harm in just trying it for a week. Just do the habit tracker. See how you like it. You, you will be surprised. You'll look back and be like, damn, I did all that. Or, yeah. So hopefully from this video, you, what you gain from this video, you can start tracking your habits and you can start to see, you can get to have visual evidence of your growth. You get to track your habits. You get to build more habits, which will propel you to become more successful, do successful stuff, whatever. If you fail to mark a habit, if you like, you will fail. Some days you will not. Complete your habits some days. Just be like that. It doesn't matter how many times you fail to mark a habit or don't fill out a habit tracker. As long as... As long as you keep showing up and you keep trying every day, you will get there. So, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Later.